Hey guys, Microfools11 here, and today is another episode of the Crazy Craft 3.0 Let's Play, and this is episode 37. And today we are going to continue working up on my rails for the mineshaft. I'm not entirely sure how far it's going. To, it is at the moment. So yeah, look at that. Don't have much, but for the creosote oil, we have about 3,500. It's going to be nearing about 4,000. Uh, very soon and then we have nine coal cokes which is actually required to make the steel uh, for the actual tracks which is a long long process but um, yeah you know we're just going to wait a little bit for that to actually happen so we're not entirely going to be working on the tracks today we're actually going to be doing other things that could be beneficial to making the tracks I'm not too sure but we'll see here but anyways if you guys can't really tell I mean I'm gonna show you guys this look at this freaking oh my god oh frick be back be get back I actually found this thunder oh, you son of a gun be, get back jeez I'm going inside I actually found this thunder staff yes in one of those big tall things there I have statues it it's freaking insane it like launches lightning all over the place it's absolutely insane guys and um, it's pretty freaking powerful if it just, uh, was able to destroy some of that. So actually, when I was actually going over there, I actually did find Pac-Man over there. So I might see if he's actually there again. Like, I don't know if he'll despawn. But if he's there, then, well, I think we're going to pick a fight with him. Which is definitely very crazy, right, to think about. Um, fighting Pac-Man. But he has about like 500 health, which is absolutely insane. And there definitely could be some pretty good loot from him. So what I'm going to try to do is actually, before we actually go out there, I'm actually going to clean out my inventory because it is a huge mess. I'm actually going to have to create another junk chest, which is pretty bad to say. But I'm going to do that and organize my inventory a little bit more you know and then before we get over there I'm actually going to enchant a pickaxe a different pickaxe I actually noticed that this first pickaxe this diamond pickaxe is a little bit less than halfway so I'm gonna try to continue and use it up but since I am at level 37 for my experience I decided that it's probably best to actually just do this and enchant it so I'm going to do that uh, Im immediately, really, I'm going to have to create the pickaxe first, but, yeah, so I'm going to make it, I'm going to make the, see, I don't even, yeah, I should probably put this portal gun away, I have so many portal guns, it's unbelievable, but I, um, I, uh, let's see, uh, yeah, I'm going to actually create this ruby pickaxe, it's actually pretty simple to make, I actually ended up with three in total of these they're actually extremely rare to find I don't know why but it freaking sucks I, like I was so lucky to be able to get three but yeah like look at these look at these no okay wrong chest why are these rubies more common than these like what what does it matter are, are they the same things or not I don't know it's kinda dumb in my opinion but I don't know that's I guess guess that's what they decided to do and then I found some more gold in the mine shaft down below which was five blocks in total it was pretty cool finding that but yeah some of these statues is actually pretty insane they have tons of ore on them and it's pretty nice to like just mine them up because like this one statue had about probably like 60 blocks of iron which obviously is a lot so, yeah. Anyways, this is a ruby pickaxe I'm going to be making, plus 18 attack damage, so it's a pretty freaking amazing one. And I'm hoping that we're going to be able to get some good enchantments out of this. Now, there is the option to actually create this ultimate pickaxe. The ultimate pickaxe, which has plus 38 attack damage, and obviously will have enchantments on it, just like this ultimate sword. But I wasn't really thinking that it was going to be necessary, because... I don't, I don't know. It's going to be, like, it would be, yeah, I mean, it would be freaking awesome to have that, but I just don't think it would be necessary for me to have it because of its power. Like, it would just kind of, like, destroy everything, but maybe in the future, if I get enough titanium and uranium, then we'll do it. But for the moment, I'm not going to do it because, 
yeah. Anyway, so let's just hope I get a good enchantment for this. I don't really want anything bad. Okay, guys, so I'm just going to randomly draw this enchantment. Hopefully, I'll get something good. I'm just going to do this one. Oh, crap. Unbreaking 3, Efficiency 5, and Fortune 3 on this root pickaxe. Oh, my God, that's amazing. That is absolutely amazing. No way. I can't believe I got that. Holy crap. I'm going to have to keep this pickaxe forever. My God, that's amazing. That is absolutely insane and amazing. Man, I just can't believe I got that. Holy crap. I'm going to have to test this out. So I get, um, I get, uh, fortune from it. So that kind of, like, duplicates it, right? So if I were to mine one coal block, it would give me, like, a, like, it would have a certain percent, a certain percent of giving me more coals or more, more coal items. I don't know, like, are they coal? I don't know. So if I mine, like, one diamond block, it would give me more diamonds. A percentage-wise, but anyways, on breaking three and then efficiency five, that's kind of I wanted with my first diamond pickaxe. But since it's with the ruby pickaxe, holy crap, it's going to be absolutely insane. Man, wow, I can't, I'm getting everything now. That's amazing. Next, I think, actually, no, I'm not, I don't really need a next because I actually have my shovel. I actually have my shovel that actually is pretty good, so I don't really need it at all. Okay, so where was this? I don't even remember where it was. I thought it was like right around here. I'm pretty sure this was where it was, where Pac-Man was. He doesn't really seem to be here, he, like he despawned. Okay, well that sucks. I was really hoping to be able to fight him and like use this. But anyways, I'll show you guys my Thunder Staff. So if we just aim it at the sheep, look at that, like freaking. I mean, I don't really know how many uses I have for this, but it does cause quite a bit of damage. And this sheep, I mean, well, actually, he didn't really die, but it would be pretty effective, I think, against Pac-Man for sure, because he's just kind of like he was just sitting here, like right. Yeah, look at that. That's like the perfect spot for Pac-Man. It's a complete square. Like that's how it looked. So I think this is like one of the spawn points for him. So yeah, anyways, that I guess is that freaking Pac-Man. God dang! I was really hoping to be able to fight him and show you guys that because he is about like 500 health, which is absolutely insane. But considering he despawned, it's kind of kind of sad. Anyway, so now I'm just gonna check out this ruby pickaxe. I was going to show you guys before I left but I actually decided to just check out Pac-Man see if he was still there but now actually I still have to repair that man <laughs> shouldn't I was I should have thought that like it was going to use be uh, that destructive okay the ruby pickaxe yes this is what I am talking about the ruby pickaxe let's go down to the mine shaft let's check this out see how powerful what was that Oh my god, there's a crab. There's a crab over here. Let's should we try it out on him? Oh my god, I'm just gonna like destroy this area over here. Very large crab. Oh my god, are you kidding me? He's getting over here. I'm like destroying this whole place here. And this thunder staff is just gonna be gone. I mean might as well just kill him, right? Why not? Why not? Yeah, let's just kill him. Kill him! He's killing the freaking Enderman! What a what an asshole! God, he's just Enderman standing right there and he's killing them. Holy shit! That freaking guy is strong as hell! Oh my god. Holy crap, I'm like destroying everything. Well, good thing I is, is that I have tons of dirt over here, so I don't really have to worry about it. But still. Oh my god, I'm gonna kill myself. <laughs> Holy crap, I wanna kill this guy so badly though. Come on! Come on! Like his, I can hardly get to him because his attack. Oh, that was like a direct hit. I was, that was a good one. Come on, I'm not getting anything on him over here. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. This thunderstaff is gonna be gone, but it, hopefully, I'll be able to kill this guy. No, the thunderstaff is out. Okay, so. I think I think there's a chance that I could actually replenish it. So the thing's not actually gone. It's actually Ooh! Oh 
Oh! Oh my god. That was so close to killing him. So close to killing him. Come on, come on, come on. Let's go, let's go. He only has 14 health. 14 health. If I could get this replenished a little bit quicker, there will be a more of a chance for me to be the this guy. I need... Come on, why is it taking so long to replenish? Holy crap. No, I'm not clucking you, dude. Not again. Get over here, you crab. This is kind of a bad thing to have my ruby pickaxe with me. I am going to go in very soon if he gets closer to me. Die! No, frick! Oh my god! Come on! I need to place this water on the ground to kind of like prevent me from falling from my death. Come on! I need to kill him! I'm not giving up on this. No! I'm dead! I'm dead! Shit! I need to get my pickaxe! I need to get my ultimate sword! Holy crap! Let's get over there! Let's go, let's go, let's go! That's so crap! You know, like that crab, he was just sitting in there and he hardly touched me. Like he was near, nowhere near me from getting me, you know? Okay, okay, okay. Let's get this stuff together. Which, you know, kind of like, I need to enchant my armor. Like, I need to make some good armor. Nothing crappy like this stuff. What is the crab at? 54? Okay. No way. No way. That is such bull crap. But he was hardly near me. Come on. I wanted to kill this guy. I'm hoping to get some good stuff from him. Well, if I kill him, that's the only real thing. Can I... Do I have any lava? That would actually be a pretty good idea. Because he's not really... You better back up, dude. He's actually pretty vulnerable. Like, well, not vulnerable, but he can't really get out of there. He's kind of stuck. I'm pretty sure that this ultimate sword... No way! No way! This is such crap. I'm... I can't believe it. I can't kill this guy. Like, his radius... You can't get n anywhere near him. You need a bow and arrow to kill him. Which is why, or if I ever have that. <gasps> no, I am going to show you guys something that might work, might not work, but this could kill him. This could kill him. I actually did test this out on a monster. Za no, it was a skeleton actually to be more specific. But I, this is what I did. I like, okay, he's gone. Are you freaking kidding me? I went over to my house, and he's gone. No. Is that him? No, I mean, there are other guys over here, but... Holy crap, a sea viper? Gosh dang it, are you kidding me? This is... This is crap! This is absolute crap, guys. I tried to kill this guy. This freaking very large crab, and he... I go over here, and he just disappears. That's so crap. Like, it just... I don't know, which, you know, is kind of a thing that I need to, probably need to focus on. Like, I just need to kind of make myself better, get some better weapons, better armor, in order to kill these guys immediately, instead of having to go back and kill them, uh, or, like, get some supplies and whatnot. Like, that's the thing that, oh, wait, did I miss something? No, I didn't. You know, it's just a thing that I'm going to have to try and do to um, get some better stuff and kill these guys, because... If they keep despawning, there's going to be no chance of me getting good stuff from them. So, I don't know. I'm going to have to try to and hopefully kill these guys without having to go back and get some certain stuff. So, really, I just need to try to... Like, wait, this guy? Yeah, no, there's tons of cluckies around here. But, you know, I'm just going to have to try to actually just make my armor better, get better weapons in order to kill these guys. It's just a thing that is going to have to be a requirement for playing this crazy crap 3.0 um but you know it's it's definitely going to take some time to get there but you know if i use this diamond armor that i have oh crap okay you know if i have this if i use this diamond armor that i have or that i'm hoping to create then i can just enchant them easily cuz i just have the ant farm that i use the termite and ant you know that's I just get tons, it's, I would get tons of XP for them and I'd just be able to enchant them every so often, it's, 
Actually, probably the thing I should do. Anyways, time to use this pickaxe. The ruby pickaxe. Oh my god. If we get rid of this water. Oh my god. Yes, excellent. Excellent. Tons of lapis. Even though I don't use it or don't need it. Actually, I need, I need some coal. So let's... Oh yes, this is what I'm talking about. This is how I want to mine. Use this awesome pickaxe. But you know, if I do also have the chance, I do and will use, or um, I will create the ultimate pickaxe. That would be awesome to use. Okay, I completely forgot about my portal gun. It would be very useful. But basically, here's what I did. I actually did it right here. I had it, I had um, the skeleton came here. I actually placed the like teleport thing there and another one there and he freaking went in it and it just killed him it killed him because he was in it it was so awesome it was such an easy kill I just was able to walk right past him no problems whatsoever and um yeah I just survived it survived his attack <laughs> okay let's place that there because the water is quite annoying but yeah I mean anyways so this pickaxe is amazing holy crap so good so clean it just mines so fast and look how much coal I have after all that wow that's what I'm talking about this is what I have needed for quite some time especially for the coal because I'm gonna be needing that for the coke oven so I'm going to place some more coal into the coke oven and uh, also check out the how much coal coke we have but you know anyways so yeah I'm getting places for this series guys it's just gonna take a little bit more time to do what I need to do and get some better stuff also I do need to figure out how to create the Hulk suit I need to definitely figure that stuff out cuz that would be amazing to use to be able to be the Hulk oh my god that would be awesome I'd be that'd be indestructible uh, nobody could de defeat me no monster to be specific but um you know just have to uh, get there eventually okay so it's night out that's not what I wanted definitely not what I wanted wow is that scary scary look at that quarry I'm actually gonna show you guys that actually it's not that impressive but that's where I mind to get all that stuff for the airport pretty freaking insane okay so I'm just going to place that into there I'm gonna get about 32 or so into that coke the coke oven I'll just let that be so anyways guys I think that's about that for this episode there's not much else that I think I'm going to be doing for this episode but anyways guys yes so that is going to be that for this episode guys I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode and if you did please leave a like I will see you guys all in the next episode so yes goodbye